it's really important for anyone thinking about applying to become a drama scholar not to be worried about what experience they have. We are looking for natural performers, we're looking for a natural talent, but we're also looking to see how you will fit in with our family dynamic um, and how you will work in performances and around the school, um, really being ambassadors for our department. There are two routes to becoming a drama scholar. One of them is you have to audition. It's a very informal process, it's nothing to be worried about. Uh, you take part in a group workshop where we look at how you're working with others and if you can collaborate well. Another route into the drama scholarship is just generally to be showing that you are willing and you are a good performer in your drama lessons. So you will be being assessed throughout the drama year and if we see something that perhaps you didn't bring to an audition and we think, my goodness, that person's got something, there is always an option to become a drama scholar later on in your time at KC. As scholars we get access to Lambda from Year 9 and we also get um, specific workshops and showcases which help prepare us for drama outside of school. Lambda lessons are a one-to-one -one lesson with our fabulous teacher Mark Gregson who's also an examiner for Lambda. He really works with them on a one-to-one -one basis to pull out their acting and vocal skills and our scholars are achieving distinctions in most of their exams which is fantastic. There are lots of productions to get involved in at Kent College whether that's acting or like makeup or costumes and we're really lucky to have the Great Hall which has so much space and it's going to be an amazing theatre to perform in. When I first came to Kent College I didn't know many people but when I had drama it was such a welcoming place and I feel like it really boosts my confidence and it made me want to audition outside of school. So with regards to the things that the students get out of the activities and the clubs is the camaraderie with it. I think we have students who won't necessarily meet from year 7 to 9 but we still are able to engage all of them with this single project where we have a lockdown island where we brought all these groups together and I think that sense of friendship and building towards something together that has nothing to do with work and it just gives them that release from all the stresses and things that they're doing in daily life and just enjoy themselves and have that escapism really, I think for all years. I can see a really bright future ahead of me and me achieving loads of goals and just being who I am.